super bold, like, you know, it's sort of concept first and just like you can see someone had, had this kind of huge idea and, you know, and then executed it. I guess some people find it overwhelming. For me, it's just exciting. Hi, I'm Pavo. I'm interested in, in the city and its architecture and brutalism. And I've been doing some photography in the Barbican. So I moved into London for over four years ago. Quite quickly, I uh, discovered my uh, love for the city. There's so much variety and everyone, I guess, can find something for themselves. What I have found was the Barbican. It used to be really, really close to our first flat and kind of loved it from the first sight. I guess, you know, a lot of people have a completely different <laughs> reaction and kind of don't get into like sort of brutalist buildings and like kind of style easily. For me, it was like, yeah, wow, I haven't seen anything like that before. Um, got my little badges, brutal. We've got the Eames. Uh, exhibition poster just you know right behind me dug up this camera this old camera and kind of decided to start practicing by going barbican regularly got a book about photography it was for, for the first time I was learning about shutter speed aperture or hard light versus soft light a lot about composition thirds and lines and and that kind of stuff. It's a real sort of basics of the technical side of photography, of light and composition. And I think Biogen's a great place to learn photography. It, it's almost like a lab for um, experimenting with composition. You know, you can always find something interesting in the foreground and you can always find something interesting in the background. You just want to capture the architectural details, which are like repeated between in different places. Certain aspects of the of the design, like reference other aspects of the design. I think it's a good place to practice photography because it's slightly more challenging, I guess, than just shooting like a sweet and romantic or whatever. Because this is more like sort of rough environment. And the concrete itself, you know, it's just, again, a lot of people just see this, you know, grey and sort of faceless and emotionless thing. For me, for me, it's actually quite, like, quite interesting. It takes, takes on the qualities of the environment or, or the time of the day. And, you know, and I guess not everyone resonates with that. I do, so for me, it was a good place to capture what I like about that raw and simple uh, sort of nature of Barbican.